Josh Klinghoffer was nice enough to, uh, when he went to the game yesterday, he, he got me this nice helmet. And then Justin and Rod, the guy who works for the Twins, got me a real one. Even better. Uh, this, is, this one's for the birthday boy over there. You know? The one with the sparkle jacket. It'll, it'll go great with the helmet. Uh, I think it was already about... By the way, everybody good? Has it been an all right night here in this wonderful day? That's nice. Let's see, someone has a sign, my first Pearl Jam concert. It's my third that I remember vividly so far. Um, what I do remember is about 10 years ago, um, sharing the stage, we, we did a, a small tour with Tom Petty and the Heartbreakers. And we had known each other going back to play in the bridge school um, that Neil Young put on in, in San Francisco. And uh, a few other times we had met, uh, Tom reached out to Mike McCready early on and, and they struck up a friendship and, and um, they enjoyed smoking pot together. And, and, and something that Tom couldn't have legally done 10 years ago. But as of August, I guess you can now. There was a tennis player in New York in the U.S. Open a couple of days ago, and I think it upset her. She, she was inhaling pot smoke, and, and um, it, it upset her. Um, well, it would upset me too. If, if you were smoking pot and not sharing it with us, that would upset me greatly. I don't know, but you might find that, that once they legalize it, then something, I don't know, I feel like I smoked it less after they made it legal. Well, it's just not as much intrigue. Uh, the, also thing, the other thing to be careful for is that they start making it insanely powerful and you take two hits and you're stuck to the couch for like three fucking days. But if you're lucky, by the second day, you, um, you realize that you, you've got some Tom Petty records you hadn't listened to in a while and then you have a nice little... The next two days are pretty good. But, um, you know, going back, uh, God, I, I felt like it was, maybe we lost David Bowie. Um, six, I don't even know how long now. That, that was a heartbreaker. And then, and then of course, uh, uh, Prince left us too early. And, uh, and then it, it just started, uh, it's just a lot of people we lost and, and um, you know, you can only be grateful for their inspiration and the music that they left and, you know, even now recently Sinead, uh, Robbie Robertson. Um, Pee Wee Herman, Paul Rubens, he left a great legacy. Um, so, um, I, I guess I'm just grateful for 
the friendship, but really grateful for the music that um, um, they left behind. And um, and I guess you know there, there's somebody else out there that, that uh, I, I get some. You know, I read the news and it can be real hard. And then every once in a while, I'll get some news that's more intimate from someone um, telling me about something important or an important loss. And um, there, there's a guy out there tonight that um, uh, lost his dear one, his wife. And yeah, yeah. Um, and, and sometimes. Uh, you know it's coming. Help! 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 You need help? Help! Help! Uh, someone over there needs some help, help ladies and gentlemen. Get some help. professionals on the case there. We got John Mooney's in. Mellow. Um, we have people coming this way. I, I, I see people moving, but maybe Thank not you. fast enough. Sorry, when they when they first raised their hands, I thought they were saying that that was the, the husband I was referring to. We're good. Okay, okay. Thanks Thank for your you. patience. I think we're all good. You. Safety first. Thank you. So I'm going to get a bit emotional here if I, if I uh, stay on this too long. I, I, I just, there's someone out there that, that lost their closest person and, and it wasn't something they saw coming. It's a lot harder when it's sudden. And um, it happened very recently and uh, you know who you are and, and I'm, I'm really humbled that you made it here tonight, that you've, you've been to many of our gigs and you felt that it could be healing and uh, it means a lot to us that you could be here and um, for all the Pearl Jam community, you know who I'm talking about, I hope you can circle them and uh, remember to keep them in your thoughts and take some care of them. I sing this one for you and Sarah. You belong among the wild flowers. You belong in a boat out at sea. Sail away, kill all. Be your 
your time. You deserve the deepest of comfort. You belong in that home by and by. You belong among the wild flowers. You belong somewhere close to me, far away from your troubles and worries. You belong somewhere you. You belong, you belong somewhere you feel free.